Oh, there's a little light coming in the door. And it's your boy Reed. I'm back with another one. Okay, I got a cello. Cello, cello. Uh, cello, I think it is, even though it's spelled like cello. Anyways, let's get into it. Uh, I just want to go over the condition of this. There's been some people asking about it. Uh, let's take a look. Somebody asked about this cello and I wish I had my GoPro camera so I could, you know, have a little, I could strap it to me and um, if I didn't have this little camera right here today, I could probably maybe do a better job with this um, little video. But somebody was asking about the case, about it because they saw the picture of the case uh, with, with the open. And it looks like a hard case on the inside. It looks like a soft case on the outside. And they thought there were two different cases. So I just want to let you know this is just one case. It kind of does. It does. It is rigid. I do consider this a hard case for sure. Yeah, it's definitely a hard case. Um, but it's only one case. You know, it looks like a soft case on the outside. And it's, uh, but the inside is kind of like a hard case. So let me show you real quick. I want to show you in here. There is some strings and a strap. It looks like a strap that you can connect to uh, this case, maybe. Shoulder strap. Now, uh, I have to... strings, there's some loose strings. So, I mean, you know, I don't know if that's going to do you really a whole, whole lot of good. But there are three here. I can't tell for sure if there there's a A, a G, and a C, and those are in the case. I can't tell if they're used. Um, wait a minute. One of these things is just a CD. Okay, this is either a DVD or a CD. Suzuki Cello School Volume 3, the Suzuki method. Now... So that's in one of the strings case. There's a couple. Now these two, the other two, it says G and C, but the cases are open. And there's another in here. This is a D. And there's a string, at least one more string in here that's just not even in a case. So I, I don't know, you know, if it's usable. I really don't know. I know it's kind of hard. Looks like it's kind of hard to get back in there. I don't see that enough. Um, oh, you're looking at the ceiling. Okay. There's the other string. I'll try to get it back in the case. And here's the strap. There's not, I mean, you know, what can you say? It's a shoulder strap. Just, I'm just a video making. Oh my goodness, I'm good at making these videos, man. I tell you, I'm just a real, real good one. Okay, so the strap and the strings on the floor now, okay? But anyway, hey, this is not a really, I'm getting a pretty good picture here. So, at least this part of the video, which is the most important of the instrument itself, is coming out, to me, pretty good. I didn't know how the lighting was going to be in here. But... What I wanted to do, it looks like there's something on there. Now, that, I, I should have cleaned this off. I've got some uh, guitar, um, the stuff that you clean guitars with, and it's more than just a cleaner. It, from what I understand, it does somewhat of a, kind of gives you a seal on the outside, kind of like waxing, kind of like a wash and wax. So... This could use that, and I'll, um, maybe I'll make another video, but I just wanted to go over this at the very least. Um, this is a really pretty case. Uh, purple on the inside. And maybe you can see this instrument. It's not showing up bad in here. I'm kind of surprised. Uh, we're getting a little reflection. But, you know, that's almost always to be expected. Um, the wood's really pretty. Especially up here. 
Um, looks like there's four strings. And there's the cello. Let's see. I want to go. I like to go over the whole thing so you can see. I didn't notice anything majorly damaged. It just looks like it's been, you know, used. I mean, it's been played. Somebody used this probably for their school instrument, maybe. I'm going to assume that's the case. Not bad. Doesn't appear to be in bad condition at all. Like I say, I need to wipe it down a little bit. Oh, the soft case came in. To, all right, now you see this thing moves. It made a good landing inside the case to the soft, <laughs> soft case. It's a hard case. Again, it's a hard case, but it's uh, that you can see it's got some good padding. Didn't bother it a bit to go down in there now. If I can show you, I don't know if you can see four by four. Uh, you, I can't read that from where I was sitting. Looks like it says Strudel model 40 slash four size four by four made in Luby, Czech Republic. And that's just basically Huh. Maybe you know about it more than I do. There's something in the middle of this. I guess that's part of the tuning thing or something. I don't know if you can even see that silver part in there. I'm sure that's meant to be something that goes up through the middle of this. Anyways, I just wanted to kind of go over this because, you know, sometimes a video does a little bit better than pictures. Um... I hope I'm covering this good enough. I just wanted to kind of go over the whole thing. You see, it's really pretty. I mean, you probably can't even, I can't notice on the camera. I'm getting a little reflection right there, but I can't notice on the camera. And you may be able to see it, and that's fine. Um, the dirt that I was talking about. There's some dirt on this. I mean, it's not dirt. It's just like, uh, I mean, it just looks like it needs to be wiped off with some of that guitar cleaner that I'm talking about that's, uh, you know, it's, you spray it on and just wipe it off with the microfiber. Uh, this part here. I know that's not how you play that, but let's see. Oh, it's got a good sound to it, too. <laughs> I play so well. I want you to see all the way down this. There's a little nick. You can probably see that. So, I don't know. I know very little about it. I, you know, let's be perfectly honest. I'm being, trying to be totally transparent here. Um. Like I said, I noticed that this piece moves. Don't know, you know, what the significance of that is. It looks like that would come off really easy. Um, I should probably ask my wife. She was in orchestra. She played the violin, I do believe. But anyways, uh, that's the strunel uh, cello. Looks like there's a little... No. I started to say there's a little bit of wear right there on that edge there. It's not a bad looking piece. Not a bad looking piece. I mean, 9 minutes and 15 seconds, I better shut it down. So, uh, if you got any questions, you can ask, and I'll do my best to try to get an answer for you.